next, inside the special effects of Hollywood's hottest films. movies like Texas Chainsaw Massacre and House on Haunted Hill. Well, the man responsible for all that fake blood and gore is from KNB Special Effects. Take a little look at his work. They're all dead. Oh, my, 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 my. work is really amazing. My heart is yours. <laughs> no, 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 no. Here we go, here we go. Look, look, look. Don't so you was, love that? This was actually moved in a, used in a comedy called Rat Race. Something so uh, a, lot of, a lot of the things that you see, we do different kinds of movies. Some are horror, some are comedy. Um, we did like Spy Kids. We did Once Upon a Time in Mexico, Cabin Fever, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. But we specialize in all kinds of different things. You can see we have um, fake bodies and fake animals. Um, over here, this, this guy on the end here, this is Jake Busey from Identity. And if you look at the detail on the hands and the fingernails, no, all that hair is punched in individually. It's frightening, the hands, all, all the work on the hands, it's so real, it's well, frightening. The amazing thing is when we wrapped production, one of the studio executives actually wanted to keep this dummy. So it was sitting in his office and he had a meeting and he didn't know what to do, so he stuck it in his closet and he forgot it was there. So the cleaning staff came in at the end of the day and no. opened up the closet door. And, had a heart and literally, they called paramedics because this poor woman thought that she found a dead body in the uh, in the closet. That is very scary. So these are all made out of silicone. This is from Bad Boys 2. There's a scene where Martin Lawrence and Will Smith are are uh, they're looking through cadavers that that have drugs stuffed in them. And this one, you should lift up the lift up the hair right there. Go on, you lift it up. So we figured since it's Halloween, we could put some candy in there and, uh, <laughs> and go from there. <laughs> oh, my God. And a lot of this is, is, you know, there's cables, there's radio-controlled things to make everything operate. You know, the, the skeleton that we have over here, um, this is cable-operated. This was in Spy Kids 2. So this, uh, the head moves side to side and the mouth opens yeah. and closes. Hello there. Hello, my baby. Hello, my baby. <laughs> And uh, same with this, uh, this little animatronic alligator right here. The, the mouth can't. opens and closes, and he can turn Call, and... Call get some dogs out of here. Another them crap. I know. I wish. <laughs> I wish. It and, feels really good. Well, it's all made out of foam latex, and then there's armatures inside to make everything move. So aside from all this, then there's also sort of the, the, uh, the blood and gore aspects of, like, we did Kill Bill, and we did all that Reservoir blood. Dogs. All right. How much blood was in Kill we Bill? We used 400 gallons of blood on Kill Bill. It's, it's not real blood. No, 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 no. It's all, it's all fake blood. But Quentin wanted 20-foot geysers coming out of all, all of the, uh, the crazy 88s as, mm -hmm. as uh, yeah. Uma is sort of slicing through. So one of the, one of the ways that we, we actually do that, a really simple, easy, easy gag, is to, to take a, uh, a, a sharp instrument, dull it down so that it can't possibly hurt you, and hook up a little tube behind it, and then you can, uh, you can make it bleed. Come here. Oh, we're going to... <laughs> Looks good? No. No? I'm gonna do it again. There you go. There you go. <laughs> oh. Does it look real? I think, I think, yeah. Uh, All right. Tell me, like, for example, how long did it take to make this? That was probably six weeks. We, we did a live cast of Jake Busey, and we re-sculpted him in that position where his head was unnaturally mm -hmm. tilted back. Then we made the body out of silicone, and then, well, as I was saying earlier, all the hairs were punched in one at a time. So it took probably a week just to do the hair work. Then once we, once we painted it and uh, added the, uh, the fake bat so that you can oh. kind of twist that around a little bit. Oh. And uh, I mean, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty realistic looking. You can, uh, 
move the, the skin around. And now, hold kinda, on here. Yes. Didn't you make a fake willy, too? Yes, for boogie nights. Oh, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, uh, there's the, the final shot in the movie where Ma Mark Wahlberg reveals his, yeah. his calling in life mm -hmm. was, uh, was actually a, a, a fake prosthetic. And the weirdest thing was that was the second version. We had actually created one that was a little more excited. Mm -hmm. And they did film tests. What do you mean when you say excited? And it was uh, a little more Explain aroused. more about this excitement. <laughs> so we had, they shot film tests of it, and they called us and said, guys, it can't be that it's got to be a little less aroused so we sculpted several versions fat bastard i want to know about fat bastard well this was from gold member don't we love him we love him well this this was this was a display head that we did you know the challenge with with that for any actor is he was mike was immersed in hot heavy foam latex mm -hmm. had a zipper up the back we could unzip him and zip him pretty easily but it was still summertime 100 degree heat we glued all the prosthetics on his face so that he could emote. When his, his face moved, the prosthetics moved. Move well, I went to the werewolf like that. And it took, and, uh, that's right. It took eight hours to put on, but when he said it's the most uncomfortable feeling you can possibly imagine. Because you're covered in glue. And you can't, and it's, 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 it's like going, falling into a vat, vat of maple syrup. It's crazy, because <laughs> especially I know for your video, you had contact lenses, you had dentures, you had lenses, finger extensions. The contact lenses were the worst, because you, you had to have a, a doctor to put drops in your eyes right. and put these whole contact lenses in. And, and it felt like somebody was sanding your eyes. <laughs> it's really, it's, it's very uncomfortable. So you have to understand when all these actors go through all these makeups, and with Mike Myers, he was not only playing Fat Bastard, he's playing Dr. Evil, he was playing Gold Member, so he, and Austin. So he had to go from character to character to character mm -hmm. within the it's course a, of a day. It's so it was really, uh, it was extremely challenging. And then this is a, a fake head of Lucy Liu from oh, Kill wait, Bill. Oh, she gets the top of her head chopped now, off. The, the hard part about that was Quentin did not want to use any computer-generated effect to remove the top of her head. Mm -hmm. He wanted it to be live on camera. So we didn't want to build her head up too high because then it would look phony. Mm -hmm. So we had to create an illusion with the prosthetic so that it looked like the blade sliced across the top of is her head. Is this the actual size of her? That's, this is actually cast off of Lucy's head. God, she's a weenie little thing, She's isn't very, she? she's, uh, no, she's, she very, is. she's very short as well, isn't she? <laughs> <laughs> well, there's another shot where they cut the rest of her off. But, um, <laughs> no, she's a tiny little thing. Greg, thank you so much thank for coming down right. and bringing all this. You're a genius. Thank you so much.